Well, howdy there, people of the YouTube planet. Today I am back and I am going to do the I Love Summer Tag. I saw it on Miss Glamorazzi and Fleur de Force's YouTube channel, which I will link in the description box below. And yes, I am wearing a pink fluffy cowboy hat. I don't know why. I just saw it and put it on. So there are 12 questions in this tag all about summer and products and loves and you know the stuff so let's get on in there guys so for bronzers i always seem to change up bronzers because quite frankly i just get bored way too easy of things but the one that i always seem to come back to for summer is the shimmer and glow face and body bronzer that i love it is shimmery, it has such good colour health, like it's so pigmented, it stays on all day and do you know where it's from? Primark. So for all you people out there that say Primark is cheap and rubbish, I disagree with you on this one because this has been my favourite bronzer for a very very long time and I would highly highly recommend it. I always seem to come back to it at summer because it gives you such a shimmer and makes you look so glammy and summery and I love it. This isn't going to surprise any of you but it would be Guava Juice by Rubicon because it is an exotic flavour and it is my favourite, 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 favourite drink. Now my lip products change and I don't really ever have favourites because I get bored very easy but so far this summer I have been obsessed and pretty much only wearing the Sexy Mother Pucker Gloss Stick by Soap and Glory so I'm pretty sure that this would be the one because it's so natural but it gives you such a nice shimmer and it lasts and it doesn't feel sticky and I'm not sure if it has SPF in it but if it doesn't I guess I'd just stick an SPF clear lip balm underneath and stick this on top because I love it and it is kind of expensive I think it's around like the £8 mark or something but it seems to last for ages so it is definitely worth it guys definitely <laughs> sitting on the beach and I do like playing in the waves but I've never been stung by like bees or wasps or jellyfish so I have like a huge phobia of getting stung so I am very like you know cautious when I'm in the sea but I'd say I like sunbathing on the beach but swimming in a pool so I'm gonna be the annoying one that says both because I just did well my hair is naturally dead straight so my hair doesn't go too crazy in the summer or with heat because it doesn't frizz very much um but it does get rather flat if i'm in the water a lot so i have been loving so far this summer the salt spray that i have been pretty much raving about since i got it and tried it and i've loved it so I think this will definitely be my summer must-have hair product because it will keep some waves in there and some volume. Sunbathing. I am probably the world's worst at fake tanning. I've done it once or twice, I think, on my legs. I did it in the winter just, you know, in case it went wrong, which it did, obviously and it kind of just i don't know it went on okay ish but for some reason it just came off my body really 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 patchy and just i wasn't a fan i would love to be able to fake tan properly because i hate being pale but it just clearly isn't meant to be just yet for me so if any of you guys know of a really good like dummy proof fake tan please let me know in the comments below. I'm not sure if this will come as a surprise to any of you and I've seen it floating around YouTube a lot lately but I love the Essie Mint Candy Apple nail polish. It's like a mint green colour. I'm loving mint green this summer so 
I would have to say this is definitely my favourite nail polish for the summer. It's really like pigmented and it lasts really really well, it doesn't chip the, like doesn't chip that quickly and I just love it. I would say that there are probably two that we have. The first one is that we all tend to play in the garden together more as a family, like we play badminton or tennis I guess sometimes. Like we play in the garden more than all stay in our rooms separated from everyone which is what we kind of tend to do in the winter and the second one I would have to say is that we will take the dog to the park a lot more together like in the winter we tend to go for walks like around the block or you know up to the local shopping centre and back or whatever but we'll only do it like on our own or with maybe one other person whereas in the summer we'll all tend to go or we'll go in bigger groups and we'll go to the park for like the morning or the afternoon or things like that so i guess i guess just spending more time together in the summer we tend to do i would say that i always seem to come back to this in the summer and it is the hollister crystal cove body mist i love this i do sometimes use it in the winter but it does tend to come out more in the summer because it is so fruity and so fresh and for a body spray it does last pretty darn well so i do highly recommend it it's like 12 pounds i think last time i got it but it lasts for freaking ages literally guys it lasts like i'm not even kidding like i get a couple a year maybe and they well and truly last me but ah oh, i can smell it now it's gonna have to spray oh oh and oh, ah um, <coughs> oh, it smells so so good guys and it's all going in my mouth moving on i know a lot of people say the meat but i have to say that i love halloumi cheese I don't know if any of you guys have had it, but halloumi cheese, when it's been on the barbecue, is just, it's just, oh, I love it. We all fight over how many of us, like, get how many slices of it. I highly recommend you try that if you haven't, because that is some good stuff. I don't tend to wear a lot of makeup in the summer, just because my skin is usually a bit better. So I don't have to, you know, cover up so much, you know. But the one thing that I always, always, always wear, because if I don't, I feel like I look ill, is eyeliner. So a waterproof eyeliner is really, really important to me. And the one that I love, particularly right now, that I am finding is really, really good and super waterproof, is the Rimmel Scandalize Waterproof Coal Liner. And I've got it in black and I also have it in blue. I've had my summer vacation or holiday if you're from the UK like me already this year as I'm pretty sure you would just tell by all the daily vlogs I've just uploaded but if you haven't be sure to check them all out because we had some fun and games and there's a dolphin show on there and you know fire magic and spongebob doing gangnam style and just why wouldn't you want to check these out seriously but anyway i've had my trip this year and my son so now i'm relying on good old british weather I better get my umbrella back out my dream holiday would be to go to la i have never been to la and i am so desperate to go I don't know why, but I would love to live in America, in LA in particular, or like Boston maybe, but I would love to live in America, particularly LA, so I would love to go over there and do some shopping and see the Hollywood sign and all of those kind of things, so I think that would probably be my dream holiday is to go there. Well, that is all for this tag. I hope you enjoyed it and, you know, 
had a bit of a smile on your face today because I know I'm weird but as long as you're laughing with me I don't mind so I hope you enjoyed it the questions were all made by Miss Glamorazzi which as I said in the beginning I will link her channel below and I tag all of you to do this tag and I've tagged some people in particular below as well if you don't make videos be sure to let me know in the comments below what your favorite things about summer are i have loads more videos coming up for you and i'm thinking of some really really cool ideas for you guys maybe even a giveaway soon who knows but you'll have to stay tuned so be sure to like this video if you did because liking it really really makes me happy and if you really 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 want to make me happy please be sure to subscribe wait it's down there these days it's down here subscribe as usual if you have any video ideas let me know in the comments below or message me or whatever you feel like all my links are also in the down bar so be sure to go check them out and come say hi to me because i don't bite maybe no promises well until next time keep watching and keep safe